by Alexandra Petri Alexandra Petri columnist offering a lighter take on the news and opinions of the day email bio follow columnist September 11 at 8.46 p.m. This is one of those things that should go without saying, but, apparently, nothing can go without saying, so, here I am, saying it. 17 years have passed since September 11, 2001. The remembrance continues. But the time before, and the day itself, both become more and more obviously the past. The styles look more and more foreign. The landline phones, the print newspapers, the songs that were on the radio belong to a music different from the songs of today, though you are not quite sure when they began to sound different when you cross the line between then and now. Time is making off with a date, and it is vanishing, a little more each year, into the story that is told about it. And with this distance comes something else, the opportunity for brands to make statement A on social media. Historically, this has not gone well. One might go so far as to suggest that it is never a welcome thing for a brand on social media to make a commemorative statement. If your commemorative statement goes well, no one notices and you gain nothing. But if it goes badly, no one will be able to forget that someone thought it was a good idea to have your anthropomorphic noodle mask and urge the get shows consumers to remember number Pearl Harbor. It is never a good look for the noodle. People are not sitting there in their living rooms across America, thinking, gosh, if Hager that horrible is not appropriately summer in his print comic strip, on this day of mourning and remembrance, I am going to send several strongly worded letters. I understand that the impulse to weigh in on trending topics can be almost overwhelming. But, sometimes, you have light to shed on trending topics, and, sometimes, you do not. Ask yourself. On the anniversary of 9-11, are people aching to hear from Applebee's? Frankly, they are not. Ask yourself. What is the best case scenario, here? Picture someone saying, Karen, come here. You have got to see the thing the Applebee's brand account tweeted about 9-11. Does it sound like Karen will be happy when she sees what the Applebee's brand account tweeted? I do not think she will be. This has the potential to be a disaster because, even if you do it with some degree of respect, you can be criticized for trying to use tragedy to sell noodles, and, if you